You're tormented. By what? Forgive me, but I must ask directly. Are you a man? I... I no longer trust my senses. Not exactly. I'm a witcher. Quite a few folk think I don't deserve to be classified as a member of the human species. No, some personally. A witcher? But no. Nor can you help me. We'll see. Just tell me what the problem is. A foulness. A demon or wraith haunts me. Grants me no rest. It wants something. I sense this, but know not what. Each day it appears, tarries, then leaves. It's here now, there, beyond the trees. Don't see a thing. Of course not. It cannot be seen. Yet you see it? Only when I drink the brew, which brings a pain to my head. Nausea. But I endure these to keep an eye on the wraith, my tormentor. What's your brew made of? Gotta wonder what's causing such strong visions. You drop in some mushroom, chumber tub, dancing dewlap? Close. The common grey top. I see you know your herbs. Grey top? Variety's extinct, if I recall correctly. Nearly, but not quite. I was able to grow a few from dried spores. I'd hoped a brew of grey top would reveal this nightmare. I was not wrong. As far as I know, Greytop produces some powerful side effects. Though it can, in fact, reveal the hidden, the immaterial. Yes, I see the evil. Better that than to know it is there, but not know where. Fine. You seem sure something's out there. I'll see what I can do. Start by taking a look around. Dead moths, attracted to some ghosts like to the light of a candle. Hmm. Seems there's at least some truth to the hermit's ravings. Common grey top, strong hallucinogen, thought extinct. You don't often get to see that. Drops of blood on the pillow, trail of them leading to the window. Shutters closed tight. Need to check the other side, see if the trail continues. Dead moths. Attracted to some ghosts like to the light of a candle. Trail of blood starts at the pillow, ends here. Medallion's still vibrating. You were very near to it. It looked at you, then galloped into us. Something drinks the hermit's blood at night. That I know. Gotta talk to her. Maybe she can tell me something more. Witcher. Most likely some kind of wraith's tormenting you. Can't tell what kind, though. Felt weak, spend lately? Notice bite marks on your skin? As I said, I feel weaker by the day. And bites, of course. There are lice and midges here aplenty. This isn't lice. Something much bigger drinks your blood while you sleep. But I do not sleep. Not a wink. He's always present, always watching. I cannot bear it any longer. Sadly, not much I can do. Can't exterminate it if I can't see it. The great top. I shall make a brew of it for you. 
I've two mushrooms left, enough for one dose. Perhaps then you'll see what I do. Brew could be our only chance to figure this out. All right, high time we tried this. If I start muttering something about unicorns or sorceresses, ignore it. See no wraith. Wow, this clover's amazing. Now that's what I call a bouquet. Who said that? Oh, you're awake. Had me worried. You were out way too long. Even considered giving you some white honey. Kinda hard to do with hooves, though. Roach? It's, uh, interesting. Gotta say, I expected a young mare to sound, uh, girlish. Based on what? Your vast experience with talking animals? Far as I know, I'm your first. Good point. It must be the brew that did this. Interesting side effect. Great, isn't it? You should take this stuff more often. Got so many pointers I could give you. Can't, sadly. Drinking this too often could prove fatal. Hey, know how you always show up when I whistle? How's that work exactly? Well, you're my human. Gotta be there when you need me. Yes, I'll be there for you, ooh, ooh, as the world falls down. Still kinda strange. You cross the ocean when I call sometimes, but then get hung up on the tiniest fence. What's that about? Uh, what can I say? Everyone's got limits. Listen, got this contract I need to finish before the brew wears off. Right. Monster won't slay itself. Let me see. First up, I need to know what we're dealing with. Follow me, and try not to trample any plants or small animals. Geralt, we gotta inspect this area closely. I'll look for clues. You stand there and... Well, just stand. Right. Will you look at that? Don't see anything here. These are hoof prints. Not just any old horses, either. These were left by an astral being. Otherworldly. We gotta follow them. Dead moths often mean a phantom's nearby. Thanks, Captain Obvious. Now, what about the smell? 
Same whiff I caught at the cemetery in Vizima when we were hunting ghouls. The smell of death smells normal to me. Not taking me for a ride, are you? Uh, seriously? All right. Now I know what we're up against. Right, Geralt. Let's sum up what we know so far. We're dealing with some kind of wraith or phantom, most likely. It visits the Hermit at night, drinks her blood. Even if we manage to find it, I've got no idea how I could possibly fight it. Geralt, please, I got this. It's definitely an Umbra, an immaterial wraith. This one's assumed the form of a horse. An Umbra actually makes sense. Umbra are completely invisible, even to witchers. But how can you be sure? Because it's not invisible to me, Doofus. It's right over there. It's getting away! Come on, Witcher! Hop in the saddle! Gotta catch it! Move it! There's the Umbra! Let's go, Geralt! After it! Hey! Gotta save my strength a bit. No telling how long we're gonna need to keep running. Gerald, we gotta have a man to horse talk. No offense, but your riding skills, they leave a bit to be desired, buddy. You'd really do me a solid if you could uh, apply a slightly surer hand, be a little more decisive about where you want me to go. <sighs> Sometimes I got no idea, buddy. Do I go left, right, toward where I'm standing? Yeah, it'd be great if you could respond more fluidly to my commands. Hey, heard this one? Horse walks into a tavern, and the innkeeper says, Hey, pal, why the long face? Ah! <laughs> Let's not lose sight of that umbra. Can you see it now? Yeah, it's right there. Run, Roach. What the fuck do you think I'm doing? <sighs> Come on. I've heard. Don't recall that ever happening. Of course you don't. <gasps> Melted into thin air. Some kind of glowy magic thing going on with this tombstone. We should check it out. Marcello Clerici. Knight. Died last year. Was more or less the same age as our hermit. Seems his spirit's become a horse-shaped umbra that's tormenting Panastri. Why are you telling me this? I can read and draw my own conclusions. 
thinking aloud, that's all. Helps me focus. Geralt! It's the Umbra! Attack! Let me explain! Talk, but make it fast. Why are you tormenting the Hermit? She torments me! Refuses to forgive me! I'm denied peace in the afterlife, and it's all her doing! Each day I come and beg her for clemency. Beg her for clemency? You drink her blood, drive her mad with fear. I don't know how to explain it, but yes! The monstrous force takes me. Though I also know I'll not have peace till the day Pinastri forgives me. Must have hurt her something awful if she refuses to forgive you. Would rather see you suffer. What did you do? To her? Nothing. But my horse, I... I, I flogged it to death. Pinastri, she saw this. A proud stallion, my blaze. But he was a bucker and tossed me during a tourney. One I'd wanted to win badly. Pinastri had been so glad they'd let me stand. Me, a peasant's son. I wanted to win it for her. But that horse made me lose. Rage overcame me. I struck and struck until at last he fell. Oh, the regret. I beg you, forgive me. Absolve me in Blaze's very name. Can't forgive you for that. Not in my power. But your horse could? Please, I'd do anything. I'm desperate. H help me. Noble Mare, forgive me my sin. Could free his spirit, pardoning him on behalf of his horse. But you shouldn't do it if you don't think he deserves forgiveness. Did a rotten thing. Got no excuse. Your horse was loyal. Did the best damn job he could. Cause that's how we horses are. True. I know I deserved what befell me. But we aren't vengeful, don't hold grudges, don't dwell on being left in monster-infested woods. So, in your poor Blaze's name, I forgive you. Oh, thank you. I feel it's incredible. Such relief, such lightness. <laughs> All right, then. Guess we might as well head back. Penastri's nights ought to be ghost tree from now on. Anything to add, Geralt? Nope. Let's go see her. Phantom's gone. Shouldn't torment you ever again. I felt a change. I did. As if I'd been released from a cramped dunk cellar. I had come to belief. No one could help me. I'm grateful, Witcher. I'm well aware Witcher's work for hire. For pay. But I've no coin, alas. I can offer only this. 
potatoes. A good crop this year. Exceptional. Ought to thank my horse, actually. Phantom's departure, mostly Roach is doing. Then I thank you too, noble creature. Gotta admit, easy peasy with our powers combined. So, what now? We hit the path? Ride to the nearest notice board? Rustle up another contract? Exactly. Oh, effects of the bruise waning. I can feel it. Won't be able to understand you soon. Ah, that's horseshit. I mean, I got so much more I want to tell you, and... <laughs> Clever beasts, horses. Farewell, Witcher. a horse to death on account of some silly tourney deserves a fate this bad. Let's kick his ass to last, Geralt. For plays! Poor hermit. Won't let you torment her again. I did what I had to do. Right. Agreed. Let's head back to the Hermits. Drove off the Phantom. But it'll be back sooner or later. It'll keep coming till you forgive Marcello his deed. It's his specter that torments you. I will never forgive him. Never. Petty rage drove him to torture that innocent beast to death. He's an evil man who deserves no mercy. He'll never let you rest if you don't forgive him. I cannot forgive him. He'll get no pardon from me. If I do not suffer for his sin, so be it. Such is my fate. Yet still, I thank you for your help. Knowing the cause grants me some respite. There's that, at least. I'm well aware witchers work for hire, for pay. But I've no coin, alas. I can offer only this. Mm. Potatoes. A good crop this year. Exceptional. Don't want to forgive him? Don't have to. But if that's the case, draw salt lines along your threshold, on your window cells. Might keep him out. Gotta admit, easy peasy with our powers combined. So, what now? We hit the path? Ride to the nearest notice board? Rustle up another contract? Exactly. Oh, effects of the bruise waning. I can feel it. Won't be able to understand you soon. Ah, that's horseshit. I mean, I got so much more I want to tell you, and... <laughs> Clever beasts, horses. Farewell, Witcher. <laughs> <laughs> 